वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल गाइस एंड लेट मी गिव डिस्क्लेमर बिफोर स्टार्टिंग द लैब इफ इफ यू आर डूइंग दिस लैब इन एनी अदर ब्राउजर लाइक सफारी और फायर फॉक्स और ब्रेव ब्राउजर सो जस्ट क्लोज दैट ब्राउजर एंड ओपन दिस लैब इन क्रोम ब्राउजर एंड वन मोर थिंग गो टू योर सेटिंग्स फ्रॉम हियर एंड गो टू योर सेटिंग्स एंड क्लियर द कैच कैचे because this lab is quite uh, uh, unusual and it's needed that you sh you must uh, clear your cache otherwise you will get unnecessary error in the uh, lab okay so once you log in with your uh, uh, credentials just open your project id and uh, one more thing uh, as i got one uh, hint from one of the telegram member so i uh, i will give credit to that guy because he is not mention his name but thank you so much for sharing that step with us and uh, if if this uh, if you uh, if if this video help for you you must give the credit uh, to the the main uh, what we can say main uh, creator of the video okay in your uh, videos or uh, any any platform okay so just copy copy command from here like this and wait for a few seconds uh, uh do not worry about this error okay so once you're done with the command click on this web preview uh preview on 844 8080 and it will open the jenkins and i i uh one yeah that's the thing guys now now done now click on manage jenkins and uh, if you just uh, broken like this you can dismiss this uh, warning also no need to worry about that now click on the manage credentials from here click on the global and from here click on add credentials and from here choose the google service account from metadata okay it will automatically choose your project id and now click on create so you have done with that everything is uh, uh what we can say as same as the previous lab now the main thing the we uh, the advice which we got from the telegram member like now again click on the manage jenkins and now click on the manage nodes and clouds okay click on here and now click on configure clouds and from here choose kubernetes wait for a second yeah done now click on here and now in the they are do not worry about this uh, this will be present this uh, sheet will be uh, present in the description box and make sure that you are open in the normal window not in incognito window okay so just copy this uh, jenkins url and scroll down a little bit and paste over here okay in the section of jenkins url now copy the jenkins tunnel value copy this and paste over here okay done now click on save now just wait for a second so we have done with that now come over here copy all this command and go to your cloud shell and paste over here wait for a few seconds and meanwhile you can copy this sample app name okay copy this let me just zoom in uh, yeah it's better okay so just copy this like this now click on here now click on dashboard now click on new items uh paste over here like this now choose multi branch pipeline and click on okay okay now from the branch sources choose git and uh, copy this paste over here make sure you do not give extra space like this and uh, in your from your project id lab page copy your project id paste over here like this okay let me zoom in for you yeah it must be look like this okay 
and copy uh, choose credentials from here and scroll down a little bit and scan multi branch pipeline click on this checkbox and from here choose one minute okay now click on save okay so yeah it's scanning and uh, and for me it finished and it's give the output like success okay unfortunately if you got the failure option over here so do one thing click on delete delete multiple uh, multi branch pipeline and again do the same thing like uh, go to a dashboard and uh, new items and uh, submit the same name sample app and do the same thing if you if you got uh, failure for multiple three or four times so you need to clear your cache again and again do the lab from the beginning okay so yeah but uh, if you got a success message as, as i got so yeah you are good to go so now what we have to do come over here copy this come over here and paste okay wait for a second meanwhile meanwhile what we do copy the username from the lab page come over here and replace with the username okay now copy the username and uh, paste over here okay it's like that and copy this and paste over here okay so just wait for a few seconds so yeah it's done now click on open editor open editor in new window meanwhile you can click on open terminal from here wait for a few seconds yeah it's done now click on this arrow now click on html.go okay now from your lab page copy the color it's uh, different for uh, everyone and yeah so copy that and go to the line number 37 first of all and change with uh, blue color with given color like red okay scroll down a little bit on line number 81 do the same thing so we have done now copy the version okay first of all copy the version come over here and click on main.go and scroll down a little bit on line number 46 we have to change the version okay and you can click on save all now go to your what we can say instruction page and change version over here also okay like this and now copy from git to uh, these four commands copy that come to your cloud shell and paste over here like this and wait for a second and now it's done okay now there is nothing to worry about just copy this come over here and paste okay now copy this and wait for it to be completed it's done now paste this okay so you will get this kind of uh, uh, what we can say output so just hit control c for terminate this output okay now copy this and come over here and paste over here so yeah done and now the we have to run last four commands copy that and paste over here okay so just wait for a few seconds so we have done now come to your Jenkins and click on the refresh button okay this refresh button so you can see uh, there are three pipelines uh, which are running right now one more thing uh, the master pipeline took around six to seven minutes and new feature took four minutes and the canary took six minutes for me uh, in my last uh, attempt uh, sometime it will take f more time okay so do not worry about that and uh, if if you got uh, like uh, one of the one of your pipeline got uh, uh, failed so just click on that pipeline and again uh, build now so here you get the option restart or build now so yeah just do that thing okay 
so now just wait for at least 10 to 20 minutes not 20 minutes 10 to 15 minutes and we are good to go and you can click on this refresh button so just check for the that your pipeline has been done or not okay so now just wait So let me just refresh one so you can see like as i told you it's, so it took around eight minutes and it took around five minutes so just now wait for the canary to be succeed and uh, if i just scroll down over here just click on the check my progress for task one yeah got it task two must be done No need to worry about this it will take few seconds to get up up updated yeah so it's done now click on the task 3 
and if I just click on ref refresh so yeah, yeah it's taking time okay so now just yeah so we got 75 we just have to wait for the last task Now again click on the refresh button and let's see so yeah it's took around seven minutes so you can see like uh, how many I mean uh, how many it, it's take okay so now come over here and click on the check my progress for last task yeah done so yeah that's it guys I hope you like the video you know the drill Thanks for watching. Have a good day.